Diddy, 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 diddy. All right. We got Diddy offers $15 million in exchange for getting bail, agrees to wearing GPS monitor. All right. For you guys who don't know, Biddy, Biddy. Diddy just got arrested again for having a bunch of freak offs. Not for having the freak offs, but the stuff that was going on in the freak offs. All right. Um, barely a day after his arrest, Sean Diddy Combs is offering $50 million bail package in hopes of getting himself out of jail this before until his trial begins. Diddy's team filed the offer with federal court. $50 million. He has $50 million just laying around like that. I mean, he's almost a billionaire, so that makes sense. Um, according to the documents, the American rapper mansion in Miami's Star Island would be put up, which is valued at $48 million. Holy shit. His mother's Miami home would cover the remaining $2 million. So he has a $48 million home, and his mom has a $2 million home. All right, all right. Uh, in addition, the music mogul agreed to be monitored by GPS and would only travel between Florida, New York, and New Jersey. Why New Jersey? Why not Cali? Federal agents have informed the judge that they have no plans of releasing Combs on bail, saying he is a danger, a danger to society and a flight risk. Damn. He's a danger to society. I mean, if you guys seen the video of him beating the shit out of, uh, what's her name? Cassie. Straight ragdolling her through the, through the hotel lobby. <sighs> it was hard to watch. Combs was arrested and taken into custody on Monday night under charges of racketeering and sex trafficking. Oh my God. During a Homeland Security raid, the music mogul's home earlier in March, authorities seized more than 1,000 bottles of baby oil and lubricant. <gasps> oh my God, some buttholes were getting bust open, for sure. During, during the, press, the press conference, uh, United States Attorney Damian Williams went into detail regarding all the Combs crimes, which included threatening women to fulfill, to fulfill his physical desires and protect his reputation, as well as using employees to engage in other crimes, such as forced labor and bribery. This guy is terrible. We will be, we will be seeking detention, Williams said, conducting or oh, concluding Concluding it by stating there is a presumption of the de of detention in case in a case like this. We think that's warranted. All right. This is the first crime. This is the first time Comb has been involved with federal agents. All right. Also, I think I've read somewhere that they were having free coughs and they were having like rooms for stray like sodomy. And like the other rooms for like just straight women, females. It was some weird shit. Combs' downfall began in November 2023 when his ex girlfriend, yes, there you go, I told you guys about it earlier, Cassie Ventura filed a lawsuit that accused him of sexual and physical abuse. I don't know about the sexual abuse, but we've seen the physical abuse on camera. I mean, he was, he was putting hands on her left and right. Although nothing serious came out of it, federal investigate. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He didn't get convicted for it because it happened more than 10 years ago. So he, he's automatically doesn't get any punishment for that, which is fucked up. Federal investigations decided to look closer into Combs' lifestyle. Authorities ex executed search warrants over his properties in Los Angeles and Miami and interviewed several people in relation to sexual assault and distribution of illegal narcotics and firearms. So he got 
sexual racketeering, sexual assaults, um, illegal narcotics and firearms. Oh my God, bro, he's he's about to go down. Uh, so his attorney, uh, Mark Agnifilo, addressed the arrest in a statement. We are disappointed with the decision to pursue what we believe is an unjust prosecution of Mr. Combs by the U.S. Attorney's Office. I mean, he's already getting paid millions of dollars. Obviously, some lawyer out there is going to defend him. He's going to have to defend him. And I don't know if he can overcome this because it might look like he will be going into jail in prison with R. Kelly. They're gonna be they're gonna be cellmates, and they're gonna be singing to each other, rapping for each other. Take that, take that. All right. Sean Diddy Combs is a music icon, self-made entrepreneur, loving family, loving family man, and proven philanthropist who has spent the last thirty years building an empire. He concluded the statement by saying he is. An imperfect person, but he is not a criminal. Bro, we've seen him on camera putting hands and feet on Cassie. So you cannot tell me this is a good person. No way, Jose. Combs has broken his silence on social media saying he will fight for the truth. What truth? Okay, this is the truth that Diddy is talking about. This is on his Instagram, apparently. Enough is enough. For the last couple of weeks, I have sat silently and watched people try to assassinate my character, destroy my reputation and my legacy. And to that, my friend, I say, you destroyed your own reputation and legacy. You decided to put your hands on that woman on camera. Not on camera, but you thought nobody was watching, but the the hotel lobby Caught, caught all the action and you only were sorry and you were apologizing it's because you, you got caught you didn't come out and admit it you said oh you know what I did this before and it's not feeling right in my in my heart like like my my soul is is burning down inside like I gotta tell you guys that I did this to to Cassie and all this stuff. no somebody leaked the video and then you felt bad about it. You didn't feel about what you did, but you felt bad about getting caught. That's the truth. Sickening allegations have been made against me by individuals looking for a quick payday. Let me be abs- absolutely clear. I did not do any of the awful things being alleged. I will fight for my name, my family, and for the truth. Sean Diddy. Combs, brother, love. All right. Okay. So and um, sorry. I, I. Yeah. So this is the screenshot. Now we have some videos that we're gonna have to watch of Diddy being fruity on camera, being weird. All right. So this is with him and Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson having to move Diddy's hand during an interview. All right. Oh yes, he's he glittering. He's glittering. He's glittering. Well, now when we come back, we're gonna talk more with Puffy, and if you want to hang out, more than welcome, stick around, my brother. Oh, All right, you. we'll be right back with more right after this. It, it truly is about the Benjamin, man. Let me see. Oh yes, he's, he's glittering. He's oh no, no, this one's not like he, he was trying to show his thing, his his ring. That I, I, that that was that's false. I don't think that's that shows that he's being fruity, but it might have been a way. Of Mike Tyson trying to move his hand because maybe Diddy was trying to cop a feel. He was trying to grab one up. But, all right, let's go to the next one. This is when Charlemagne played Diddy, an audio audio clip of him from his party, okay? Remember what I was saying. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Would you like a reminder? Yeah, sure. Play some. Yeah, play. No. Hey, yo, this is, yo I, I love it all. I love it all, man. I like when you like this, Daddy. Yeah, yeah, Oh, that was with the drink champs. Oh, I watched the whole episode. He was being so weird. He was like, yo, fabulous. Me and you go party party. We, I want a party party. Just me and you. Like, you never invite me. 
Like for me, for my birthday and your birthday, we're going to party, party. Like he was being so weird. I became. Mm. Did you miss me though? Mm. For real? Because we, I'm I saying, miss, it seems like a thing. I miss his birthday with party. Puff, man. man I miss but I'm talking about for him. your birthday. Huh? Why won't you party with me for your birthday, man? I, I, we, we party for my birthday before. You came to my party. And, and no, but me and you ain't never really party. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Eyes, eyes. <laughs> Daddy, I like when you, when oh, you right scrambling here, right and scraping for no, 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 shit. No, no, no. That was you. Scrambling. <laughs> <laughs> what? You said, I like when you do it like that, Daddy. <laughs> when you scrambling and scraping for shit. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> Miami. Hey, his, his, My body count is his response was, hey, man. I mean, what else can you say? Like, it's 4K. Well, yeah, 4K. Like, you can't. Didn't, like, you said that, bro. There he is. Let's do it. Before we begin, how do I address you? You can call me Love. And you've referred to yourself differently over the years, so I gotta ask you. Puff, where did that come from? I can't tell you that. <laughs> What's one misconception about you? There are no misconceptions about me. What's one thing you need every morning? I need a hug. I think it's all about love. By the way, whatever happened to that uh, Fonsworth Bentley guy? Oh, Fonsworth is doing great. Who's the one artist living... He just looks creepy, bro. ...or dead that you wish you can collaborate with? Michael Jackson. Why? Rest, you know? Mm-hmm. Very... That was weird. <laughs> this is Diddy right here. Diddy is right here. Diddy was moving zesty. Another one. Another one. There's going to be a last one, and then we're going to wrap this up. Hey, what's up, King Son? Man, you doing it, man. You deserve it, Daddy. You putting in that work. I'm proud of you. I love you. What kind of work? What do you mean by that? What kind of work? It looked like... It looked like Meek Mill was... was Icing his butthole. It looked like he was just working him out. Got him to the pool. And now he's like taking a break. He's like, man, you done, you done, psh, you done tore me up. I work. I'm proud of you. I love you. Yeah. Hey, what's up, King Son? Man, you doing it, man. You deserve it, daddy. Man, what's up with calling, like, grown ass men calling each other daddy? That's just. That is just some Togaf shit. You know, spell that backwards. Anyways, uh, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. See you guys in the next video.